Making your application to court. Going to court can be very stressful. Family mediation can be quicker, cheaper and easier for everyone. A mediator is a qualified person who is independent of the court and will not take sides. Before you put your application to the court, you will have to fill in and send a form called an FM1 form with your application to the court, confirming your attendance at a mediation information assessment meeting or confirming why you are exempt from attending. The application for a court decision. Going to court is a last resort if you and the other person cannot agree on what will happen next and you need a judge to make the final decision for you. Remember, the law says that the court must always put the welfare of your child first. What you want may not be the best thing for your child. If you are applying for a contact or residence order, you will need to complete a C100 form and send in two extra copies of the filled in form. If you have more than one person in section 3 and 4 of the C100 application form, you will need to send in a copy for each named person. If you are making allegations of harm against your ex-partner, you will also need to fill in an additional C1A form. Again, sending two extra copies of the filled in form. It is really important that you provide all of the information asked for in these forms. If you don't know the answer to any of the questions, write not known on the form. Your case may be delayed if you do not fill in the form as fully as you can. When the court gets your application, they will arrange a date for your case to be heard. This is called listing for a hearing. Remember when you fill in the C100 form, it is important to give any dates that you are unable to attend, as it is difficult and time consuming for the court to reschedule. Please refer to leaflet CB1 for more information on making an application. Fees. There is a court fee to pay for making an application. Information about court fees can be found in the EX50 leaflet, Civil and Family Court Fees. In some cases, the fee does not need to be paid, or the whole fee may not need to be paid. Read the combined booklet and application form EX160A, Court Fees, Do I Have to Pay Them? Serving the papers. The court will keep one copy of your forms and send all of the other copies back to you. A copy is for you to keep. You need to give a copy to the other parties involved in your case. This is called serving. You can serve by sending papers through the post. You must serve everyone who you have put in section 3 and 4 of the C100 application form. These people are called the parties. Make sure when serving you have included their copy of the Notice of Proceedings Form C6, a copy of C100 and C1A if applicable, a copy of any other papers which the court office has allowed you to file at the court, for instance a copy of a court order, a blank statement of means if you have filled in Form C10A, and an acknowledgement Form C7 if the court office has provided this form. It is your responsibility to make sure that you send all parties involved the paperwork at least 14 days before the first hearing date. Finally, after serving, you must send to the court a Statement of Service Form C9 to prove you have served everyone. You will have received a C9 in your paperwork. If you have any problems serving the papers, contact the court. The court will also give your paperwork to an organisation called CAFCAS in England or CAFCAS Cymru in Wales. They will get in touch with you and the other parties by telephone before the first hearing to ask you some questions about your child. This helps them to give the judge some advice about the case before he meets you. Summary. Key steps in a court application. Consider mediation first. Fill out a FM1 form. If mediation is unsuccessful, fill out a C100 form. Serve the correct documentation to everyone included in Section 3 and 4 of your C100 form. Send to the court a Statement of Service Form C9. All of the forms mentioned in this video can be found at justice.gov.uk using the Form Finder tool or from a family or county court office.